I'm Michael, and I'm here in a residency by the province of Upper Austria. So I'm mostly doing kind of exploratory work into the fields of virtual reality, augmented reality, but also models, models of the world, which is kind of the basis for both of these ends in a way. <coughs> so I'm looking into climate models, for instance, and then turn stuff uh, like the, the resulting data into objects, like you see here, for instance. I'm mostly dealing and exploring what I kind of term the X-realities or the kind of field that opens up between those two very different meanings of XR, between uh, extended reality and extinction rebellion. So that sounds a bit complicated, but <laughs> basically what I mean about this, there's on one hand, uh, like the big technological companies uh, postulating uh, the metaverse, trying to sell new devices and data and whatever. And on the other hand, there is uh, like a citizen movement against the against actually the ecological and whatever kind of disaster or way of uh, living and, 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 and doing business uh, turns out to be. So. <coughs> yeah, these are uh, data objects or data sculptures. Basically that's temperature data of the last 120 years on a country-based level. Or this is like the land ocean average. All the others are country-based data. That, for instance, is Austria. This one is Canada. So there's different versions. Uh, what we also have here is a series of mashup sculptures. So I actually started them like two years ago, but I'm still kind of improving the models somehow. I have a series of, of, of these objects or these virtual sculptures. These are mesh-up sculptures. So I used like classic 3D scans of classical uh, sculptural art. Like for instance, this is the Finca. This is the Venus of Willendorf, which is one of the oldest art pieces found in Austria like 30,000 years ago and mesh them up with artifacts of petroleum culture. For, for instance, the, the oil drum, or basically the drum is uh, a symbol or a container of uh, various kinds of toxic materials uh, it was used for. So this is actually myself, that's a self-portrait, but otherwise I, I started out with a series of these fine art classics and turned it into an augmented reality exhibition and this sooner or later or part of parts of it into real objects. I'm working on various uh, bits and pieces on the end as it's kind of exploratory. Part of my uh, experiments with virtual reality I created a uh, which combines all these things in a way, my work on, on, on data and uh, uh, virtual reality, dealing with the kind of the classical demo of virtual re reality apps like a roller coaster. And I created a first prototype of a roller coaster that takes you along real data. So it rides along real data, for instance, like again, temperature data over hundreds of years, crude oil prices, Bitcoin prices, CO2 concentration in the atmosphere over 80, 100,000 of years. <coughs> so it puts you into a very, uh, in a way, sensual and emotional contact with this data you normally just see as curves on the screen.